Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel, Electron TV. Okay, for today problem guys is this circuit breaker, Merlin Jerin. And the trouble or the problem is we cannot close the circuit breaker by remote or here. Okay, and if you watch my previous video this breaker we have a problem because they were always stripped and the technician came on board to replace the micrologic controller and he also checked the problem with this remote control and he was said the problem was the closing coil but he cannot replace because he don't have spare at that time And now guys, I received this closing coil, therefore, I need to install. And we will see if the troll or the problem is this closing coil only. and 200 to 250 volts AC or DC okay so we need to rock out the circuit breaker to install this. and this closing coil guys is inside the circuit breaker at the top okay now guys I uh, rock out the circuit breaker so here I use the rocking handle or lever and uh, before you put the rocking handle we have a push button near beside the hole you need to press first to enter the rocking handle and after you enter the rocking handle turn counterclockwise And every time they have indicator beside, they change the position, you need to press again the push button. I'll show you the push button guys. That's the push button you need to push to continue. Okay. Now I push, continue to turn, counterclockwise. And now it's done. You see the indicator is already disconnected. And to pull out the circuit breaker, you need to press mechanical lock both side press and pull out okay and now guys I remove the cover and here is the closing coil guys that we need to remove and replace check the part number if the same 033662 it's the same guys so okay
Yung mga tanggalin po sila. Sa terminal. Now, I remove first the cover for the terminal. Okay, just uh, put a marker. And now, I remove the lock. That's the closing coil. And the other one, guys, is the shut up coil to open the circuit breaker so, now ito yung tinesting yung problema wala na siyang force hindi niya na kaya itulak yung ito now guys i installed the new Pareho din yun yung kabila, ano? Ano ba yung para yung isa? Saan dyan? Ano to sir? Sa shut off? Sa... Ito, sa closing. Sa closing. Sa off pala yun. Kaya pag pinalitan, ito closing coil. Ito, shut off. Open. natin tumatesting, kailangan may power sir, maya mamaya pa natin tumatesting hmm. pag tumatakbo na pa <laughs> ito natanggal yung spring nito na karang uh -huh. and this is for a reset Yun? or reset button yes, sir, sir. And now guys, we are uh, rocking in the circuit breaker. signal na to pag nasa test na lalabas ulit yan. Yan, tapos tulak muli, push ulit. Yan. 
sila. Sige lang, wala yan, sir. Yung stopper naman, ayun na. Mm -mm. Pag tumutok na siya sa connect, yun na yan. Wala, mm -hmm. finish na. Tigas, sir, wala pa. Tigas pa yan. Tigas pa yan. Yan, malapit na. Sige pa. Ano pa lang yan? Malapit na. Sige, yan. Sige pa. Okay, finish na. Yan. Tapos balik nila yan, sir. Okay. Mamaya na natin yung test. Level lang yan, sir. Diyan nakadikit sa taas, eh. And now, I will test if it's working before we switch on the breaker for the boat tester, we need to close the coupling switch for the supply of the reefer. I turn to stop to switch off or disconnect the coupling breaker or switch after that I close the shaft generator breaker that's the indicator now I switch on the circuit breaker for the shaft generator Now the boat thruster selector switch to normal and press this button. But the problem is not solved, it's still not working, guys. That's why I continue to troubleshoot and find the real trouble. So the problem is not the coil because we replace and still not working. Now guys, I open the top cover of the circuit breaker to check the terminal and what I found guys, we have uh, one wire disconnected here and that wire was the supply for the closing coil because that wire was moved upward or it's not in the proper position reason to open the contact that's why the closing coil did not work and now I put back in the proper position see that a wire that have a scratch that the one based on the manual the diagram that connection here the reason why I did not close the breaker because the connection was uh, removed here the closing contact was open because of that okay now I put back and let's check if it's working now and I hope that's the only problem now guys uh, we test again close the breaker for the shop generator okay close and boat thruster put selector switch to normal and press the button now guys it's working so problem solved finish for today guys I hope you learned something in this video 
and thank you for watching if you like my video guys don't forget to click like and subscribe to my youtube channel lecton tv thank you guys and see you next time